Lizard Lunge, and Tripod Quad. With a nice deep inhale, slowly rising up. We're going to step the left foot outside of the hands and the right knee slides back, releasing the right toes. The left toes turn out to the left slightly and the hands go wide. Fingers turn out. Allow your hips to track all the way forward. Hips come forward, chest lifts up in front and allow the neck to stay soft and long. We're going to begin swaying all the way left and all the way right. Be sensitive and notice where you're holding tension. Breathe deep into your body. Flowing left and right, keeping the weight in the forward position. Through duration, we allow the body to melt, being nurturing and non-aggressive as you continue surrendering into the posture. Deep, rich breaths. You can close your eyes as you're flowing back and forth, sensing, breathing, Second option, sinking the forearms or elbows inside the left heel. If this is too much, you can either use a bolster under your forearms or just stay on the palms. We continue swaying gently left and right. This explorative movement is a way for you to disperse the stretch through all the muscle fibers around your hips and thighs. We take a third option, which is tripod quad. Right hand under the right shoulder. Left hand reaches back for the top of the foot or ankle. We explore a bit of movement here. Left shoulder opens up, heart to the sun. And then shoulder down, heart to the earth. Opening up and slowly bringing it down. As you move through this range of motion, feel how you're rolling across the muscle fibers in the front of your right thigh. If you need extra padding under your back knee, under your right knee, you can fold up a towel or put a small pillow to create a little bit of comfort. This is a very powerful way to open the quad and hip flexor. never straining. It's not mind over body. It's being mindful of your body. Slowly progressing in each of these postures and breathing through. We come back to center, grounding into turtle. Elbows next to the knees, head between the hands. Take a couple of deep breaths before we move to the other side. Slowly inhale as you rise. And we move into the other side. Right foot steps outside of the right hand. Left knee slides back and release the toes. Fingers turn out, hands are in a comfortable position under the shoulders. Allow your hips to track forward, lift the chest in front. You can Slightly tuck the chin and lengthen through the crown of the head. Slow deep breaths as you begin to explore the movement left and right. Feeling your way through the full range of motion. This explorative movement is to help you tune in to where your body is holding tension. If there's a, a space or an alignment that feels really good, you can hold it and breathe into it directly. Through moving back and forth, we disperse and distribute 
the intensity of this stretch through the joint, affecting more of the muscle fibers and more of the fascia. Deep, rich belly breaths. Eyes can be closed. Just feeling, sensing, and breathing. If you want to take it to the second option, we drop the elbows inside the right heel, resting on the forearms. If you feel at all that you're straining to be in this position, come back up to the palms, or again place a bolster under your elbows. We can explore gently left and right. Deep, rich breaths are the key to unlock the hips. Breathe powerfully to match the intensity of what you're feeling. If you'd like to come into the third option, tripod, left hand under the shoulder, right hand reaches back for the top of the foot or ankle. First position, right shoulder drops onto the right thigh. Second position, right shoulder opens up heart to the sun. We inhale. And exhale, bringing the shoulder down, heart to the earth. Flowing back and forth. Being sensitive to what you're feeling and exploring your body. If anything feels awkward or uncomfortable, always take the time to make an adjustment. If you need padding under your back knee, you can fold over the side of your mat or place a pillow or towel or something under your knee for extra padding. Continue deep, full breaths, moving through the range of motion. Repetition is the key, duration, rather than intensity. We slowly release, coming into turtle. Head between the hands, knees together, and grounding into the earth. Stay with your breath. 